everybody welcome back to my channel today's video as you can already see by the title i'm doing another what i eat in a day um a couple of reasons for this first reason is i wasn't meant to be filming today but as you will know if you've um if you've been around the last few videos i've got builders doing an extension at my house at the moment um and they've decided they don't want to work today which is great so i'm taking full advantage of that and filming with you guys and being relaxed whilst I film. So that's why I'm kind of not prepared. Um, so I thought what I'll do is what I eat in a day. I know I've done these before, but like I've said before, I find them really helpful. If you're just starting off um, on a new diet, counting calories, and you're a bit stuck, you don't know what to do, and you think, oh my God, I need to cut everything out. This is a place for you because you don't need to cut things out. Um, I can just give you ideas. You can just eat normal. As long as you're on a calorie deficit and you are counting your calories, you will lose weight you will lose weight. So you don't go thinking, can't eat chocolate, can't eat pasta, can't eat carbs or whatever. You can, you can, and I will show you <laughs> that you can. So yeah, that brings me on to my next reason why I'm gonna film this video, because I'm going on holiday in July and I need to get like back on it. Like I am still counting calories, but I'm just being a bit more lenient. I'm like, oh, I'll just have that, I'll just have that. And I think the reason as well is the weather like, I don't know about anyone else, but when it's sunny, I will eat healthy. Like, I want a, I want salads and I want healthier food. But when it's not sunny and it's cold, I just want, like, all the comfort sort of foods. I know I'm not alone, but most people are probably the same. Um, which is why I'm just like, oh, I'll just sit on the sofa and have loads of chocolate. And it's been Easter. So, um, yeah, I want to get back on it. And because the builders have been here, I haven't really been going to the gym. So I need to get back on it, do the gym, get my food in. So I thought, yeah, I will film a video with you guys um, and get back into it. So before we do get into it, I've also got another two things I want to say. First one is the eyebrows. Like also, if you've been here for the last few videos, you will know that my, my eyebrows have been microbladed and you're probably thinking, please stop going on about it. But I worry that there's new subscribers new viewers looking and thinking what on earth is wrong with your eyebrows basically i've got them microbladed um they are healing but they are at that stage where they're very dodgy like look at this one like i've had the bit where it's really really dry but it was my eyebrows are still like one color like a block color but now they're all patchy so i'm trusting the process but they're dodgy at the moment so that is why <laughs> just in case you're wondering second thing i want to do before we go into the video is if you are new here, um, please go and hit that subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. Um, if you're not new here and you watch my videos but you're not subscribed, please also go and hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to a thousand subscribers and I would love you guys to join the journey with me. So please, you don't even need to pause this video, hit the button, I think it's here or here. I can't remember because it mirrors, I don't know. Anyway, go hit that subscribe button. I'm hungry, let's have some breakfast. So for breakfast this morning, I'm gonna be having probably the most boring breakfast I could think of. Great way to start the video. I, I really fancy it because it's not sunny. I don't want some cereal. I, don't, I, I want a slice of buttery toast. Just, it's not sunny. I just want something warm and nice and cozy sort of thing. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna have that. I'm only actually gonna have one slice of toast. I would usually have two. Um, the reason I'm having one is because I'm having my breakfast quite late and I don't have two slices of toast and then have lunch like an hour later. I probably will still have lunch an hour later, but it makes you feel better, you know? Um, and I know already what I'm having for dinner and it's quite high in calories. So I'm being tactical, just having one old slice of bread. I feel sick with hunger, I'm popping this in. There it is. You can't even see that butter on there on the camera. There is lots of butter on there. I don't think you can beat a nice buttery slice of toast, genuinely. You can't. So I've used this butter. It's Aldi's one, just a light butter. And so it's low in calories, so I just think, why waste calories on something like butter when you can have it later on? Do you know what I mean? The, the tip from me is go for low calorie things where you can, 100%. Butter, unless you really love the taste of butter, which I do, but once I get once you get used to another butter or another thing that's lighter, you forget about it. Does that even make sense? Um, I've got to go. My battery is flashing red at me and this will be cold by the time if I go upstairs, come back down and do it, change it all over. So this is what I'm having. Um, sorry if I just blabbed. Sorry if I'm blabbing now, but 
I'm panicking because it's flashing red at me. So, food for lunch. So just made my lunch and today I'm having a wrap with some chicken roll, some cheese, the 50% less fat one, a light garlic and herb soft cheese and a bit of lettuce. Um, and let me put you down and I will show you what else I've got. Right, so I'm sat down and I can actually talk to you properly. So yeah, that's what I've got in my wrap. Um, and to go with that, I've got some palm bears. And they're actually salt and vinegar flavour palm bears. Um, the reason I wanted to sit down is because I was conscious of um, me blabbing earlier. Sorry, half my head's cut off. I just have to sit like this. Um, yeah, blabbing earlier because of the red battery that was flashing. Um, and I know I've gone on about it in other videos, but honestly, low calorie things are literally your best friends. You don't have to go like everything low calorie or light. Um, but like these crisps, for example, they're 65 calories. Um, and a packet of normal Walkers crisps are 128 now for the basic the same thing why would you waste that amount of calories when you can have it later when you sat on the sofa watching telly do you know what i mean like and i i don't know about anyone else but i always let me start eating i will always um oh the cheese has come out let me hold it this end i always need a packet of crisps with a sandwich otherwise it doesn't feel like i'm having my lunch properly so yeah low cal check your low calorie things and same with like all the ingredients that's in here and like the butter that I had for my toast this morning. It's all light because it all counts. Um, and to be honest, if I use like full fat stuff, that could be like an extra 150 calories that I've used up in basically nothing. It's just the spreads, do you know what I mean? So I also try and get as much water in as possible as well. I try to have a minimum of two of these a day. I don't know how much is in there to be fair. I reckon maybe a litre. These palm bears. I saw them the other day in, where were they? B&M I got them from. Um, and to be fair, I don't actually think I've ever had something in a pom bear. I've only ever had the um, ready salted. I'm just looking on the back because they've got two different flavours. I didn't even know they had cheese and onion. Mm. If you've never had a pom bear, this is it. Literally a little bit, a little bear. It's my crisp. Also, a little tip for anyone that is kind of just starting out um, counting calories. Like what I've just done today is I know what I'm having for dinner. So I have added that into my, I use my fitness pal for it. I don't know what anyone else would use, but I use my fitness pal. So I've added that in. I'm not going to tell you what it is because I want you to stay tuned. But I know it's harder if you're doing like different ingredients. But I've been doing counting calories for so long now that I kind of know how many things are so say i'm having like i don't know chicken and chips i averagely have about 100 150 grams of chips i've kind of got used to how many grams of things i have so I, if i if i'm hungry at lunchtime i will then go and quickly put in what i'm having for dinner so i know how many calories it is and how many i've got left so if i think right i really fancy another bar of chocolate at lunch then I know I have the calories to do it. So today's one is quite, my dinner tonight is quite an easy one that I can just chuck in the calories so I know how many calories I've got left and then how many I'm gonna have left after dinner so I can have some sort of pudding. So it's quite easy to finish so then you're not like playing the guessing game. Right, let me finish this and then I'll let you know what sort of other bits I've got with my lunch. So I've just had an apple, I didn't show you because you know what an apple looks like but if you didn't, this is, just like the one I had. Um, but, oh God. But the main reason I've come back here is because I want to show you my chocolate bar. So, I've got one of these. I don't know if any of you tasted it before, but a few weeks back I did a new in taste test in Aldi. It was Noppers and they were like actual like bars, chocolate bars. And then I went into Home Bargain. No, I didn't. I went into B&M and saw these and they're like wafers. Now these are quite high in calories. I wouldn't usually have them like with lunch. Um, I would usually have something lower in calories, like gold bars are a good one. They're like 80 calories. So that like eight between less than 100 would be my lunchtime snack. But these are actually, I think they're 137. It doesn't say it on them, but I've just scanned them into the thing and I think it's 137. So let me show you. The ones from Aldi and more like a chocolate bar than a wafer, but it's basically like this. 
when I can get it out. It's basically like this in a chocolate bar, it's covered in chocolate. It's great. So this is it. Yeah, so this is it. So it's like wafer, chocolate. There's like nutty bits in there. Honestly, please go try it. It's great. A little bit messy, but amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna go finish this, get back to doing some work. Um, likelihood is I won't have like an afternoon snack. I don't really have snacks. I'm more one to like, I don't know, I've probably said it before, but in my head, I need to get out of it. But in my head, if even if I, if I came down at like, <clears throat> just like two o'clock now, nearly two o'clock, if I came back downstairs at about four o'clock or something and wanted like, I don't know, another chocolate bar. Sometimes I would have it, but it makes me feel less healthy. Even if it's in with my calories, I don't know why it's in my head. Is anyone else like that? I know I need to go out of it because I know that if I had a small chocolate bar in an hour or so, and if it in with my calories, it's absolutely fine. Like there's nothing wrong with that. But for some reason I prefer doing breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then something for pudding. I don't like snacking throughout the day. If I snack throughout the day, I just feel really slobby and unhealthy. <laughs> but I suppose we all kind of, well, whatever suits you to be honest. Anyway, enough blabbing, I'll see you at dinner. Good evening, uh, eyebrows, update on the eyebrows, but bits of like falling off, scabby skin. Anyway, this video isn't about that, so shut up. I'm about to put my dinner on. I'm gonna talk quick because I've got other food just cooking there. So for dinner this evening, I'm gonna be having a pizza. It's a Friday night and I'm treating myself to a pizza. I was gonna have it with chips, um, but pizzas are quite high in calories, depending on what one, sort of ones you have. But this one, for the whole pizza, it's uh, it's nearly 900 calories for just that, um, which is quite a lot, which is why when I said earlier, when I was having my lunch, that I had to be tactical <laughs> with what I was gonna eat. So I'm not gonna have chips with it. I'm literally gonna have this, probably a bit of salad, um, and then, the remaining calories that I've got for today, I'm gonna have some sort of pudding with them later. So yeah, I'm gonna check these in because I'm starving. Dinner is served. As if I put a few more um, mushrooms on there than what should have been because I had some left over in the fridge that were gonna go off. So I thought, you know what? Why not? I love mushrooms. And that was already a bite of that because I was just doing it for my, um, my thumbnail. That was a bit of a nightmare. I put it on the pizza tray when I got it out, it was basically all stuck to it underneath. So I had to get a really sharp knife and go underneath. It's very stressful. I've got some mayonnaise to go in there. So this is light mayonnaise. Did I say I'm having salad? I don't know if I did, but I've got, I've got salad. Um, if I'm honest with you, I don't really weigh out my salad. Um, there's bits of, you might be able to see there's bits of cheese in there, sprinkled that cheese, the same sort of cheese I had for my lunch. Um, obviously I'll weigh that out, but the other stuff, I never bother weighing it. Although, saying that, back when I first sort of started, I was like, I've, you know, like on, off, on, off, doing sort of being healthy. I remember it was the first lockdown, I don't know whether I've said it before, it was the first lockdown in 2020. And when we basically thought, oh, we're only being in lockdown for like three weeks. Um, I had my sister's wedding and I had a holiday to go on that year. So I was literally right, like, right, this is the time, we're inside. I will stick to diet and I was religious to that diet, like counting every bit of cucumber, lettuce, which is great because I did lose the weight, but I was a, like, I wouldn't have like, I can't think of what I'm trying to say. I wouldn't have the slightest thing without including it, like a cucumber, like how many calories is a cucumber, but I would include it. Um, and now I'm just a bit more lenient because like how many calories really are you gonna get in that? I'm fine. I'm sure I would have cut some out, but looking at the camera now, I've been talking for six minutes, so I am going to eat this because my food's gonna go cold before I finish it. So I will see you when I'm gonna have some sort of pudding, snacky sort of thing. So yeah, see you in a bit. It's a few hours later um, and I'm sat on the sofa, chilling, literally just chilling, watching some YouTube, catching up on a few channels. Um, so I'm gonna have a bit of pudding. I was gonna have, earlier I was thinking about having some chocolate, but we walked the dog earlier and nipped into Tesco's. Um, but I, you know what, I really fancied some, well actually no, I didn't fancy these. <laughs> I didn't fancy these, there was just nothing of what I wanted left. I fancied some Starburst, and I, I waited outside of the dog and I said, if there's no Starburst, get me Frutella. Frutella is good, isn't it? 
and Star Wars. I've been thinking about, about that for a few days. I don't know why, I just really fancy some. Um, but there was none of either left. So he picked me up from my whams. Now these are underrated. Um, and you know what? I am glad I saved some of my calories from earlier um, and didn't go and eat like, didn't have the chips or eat more chocolate with my bre uh, with breakfast, with my lunch because calories in these are pretty high. These are Moorish, aren't they? When I'm just sat on the sofa chilling, like dangerous. Although the only good thing about this, I think I've said it before, is sweets when they're in a packet, in a wrapper, really irritate me. Like Starburst, if I have to keep opening them, it does actually really annoy me. So he bought himself a pack of Mawan pinballs, which I would just sit here and eat them all. Whereas because it's these it wrapped up, it's just effort, you know? Effort I have to unwrap them. So let me have one. Strawberry. I'm gonna have to do it with my teeth because I'm holding you. Yum. I was just trying to think of what is my favourite flavour. And I don't I don't think I have a favourite flavour. Um also sorry if you can hear someone else talking. My boyfriend's upstairs streaming and he's got his door open, so I can hear him. So sorry guys if you can hear him. Anyway, I'll wrap this up quickly because if, if you can't hear them, it's probably really annoying. Anyway, if you haven't had Marwans before, the flavours you can get are cola, strawberry, apple, raspberry, orange, and cherry. And I just had a strawberry one. They are all good. I don't have a favourite. I was going to say cola, but then I was looking at the other and I was like, oh, but I like that one. I like that one. I like that one. I like more. Anyway, I am going to wrap this video up here because I don't really think I'm going to eat much more tonight apart from sit here and eat these. I was going to have a can of Coke, but... I would rather eat my calories than drink it. Um, so yeah, that is the end of the video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. This isn't what I eat every day. This is just what I eat in a day today. So yeah, please take everything with like a pinch of salt because if you're trying to start a diet, um, please do not just follow and think, right, that's what I've got to do. Because everything is different for everyone and that's why I haven't told you how many calories I'm on because it's different for you guys. Anyway, hopefully posting this video will give me the oomph to get back on it. She says that she's about to get in, bite into another Mawam. So, as always, and like I said at the beginning, if you are new here or if you just aren't subscribed already, please go and hit that subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. Um, but that is all for now, guys. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.